reactance offered by a capacitor to alternating current of frequency 50 Hz is 20 ohm. If frequency is increased to 100 Hz, reactance becomes. Then capacity of reactance, Xc. Xc is the case of Xc is 1 by C omega, 1 by C into 2 pi F. This is the case of Xc inversely proportional to frequency. Now, what do you say? Reactance offered by a capacitor in alternating around 50 Hz is 20 ohm. <coughs> okay. 50 Hz is 20 ohms. X is the same. Now, 100 Hz is the same. 100 Hz is the same. Free inversely proportional. So, Frequency double either in all XC half out. Pindu verum 10 ohms and all the item. If it answer it, okay, inversely proportional either under. Pin answer either 10 ohms. Okay, next question. Which of the following is not considered as fixed cost while calculating cost of electric power generation? Now, Graham, electric power generation and number cost in a class which is the fixed, fixed cost under then. Uh, KW proportional cost under then KW is proportional cost under. Then the fixed cost is the same as the fixed cost. The fixed cost is the same as the fixed cost. We install the plant and the cost. The cost is the same as the cost. Salaries of high officials, interest on capital cost, repair and maintenance cost, taxes and insurances. Then, okay, repair and maintenance cost is the same as the Repair and maintenance cost in the running running cost. No. plan to work is the end the generation depend on cost and running cost. Now, the fixed cost is the repair and maintenance cost. Okay. If power factor is unity, reactive power is. Power factor is unity. That is cos phi 1. Reactive power is the same. Reactive power is the Root 3 VL. IL sin phi on a cos phi 1 on angle. Okay, I'm sin phi 0. I like panganic reactive power and the norm root 3 VL IL into 0 norm. I think 0 in the very big equation by salary. You can throw no like and I'll show you now. Unity power factor on your full power and useful power on a reactive power on a full power active power on angle reactive power in a moment 0. Okay. <coughs> Reactive power is 0. Then, in a series RLC circuit, R is equal to 100 ohm, XL is equal to 300 ohm, XC is equal to 200 ohm. The phase angle of the circuit is? Okay. R, XL, XC, all of them. Just to remember the triangle. R is equal to 100 ohm, XL minus XC. And the way, XL minus XC is equal to 300 minus 200, that is 100 ohm. Varium. Then, this is the power factor angle phi. This is the power factor angle phi. This is the power factor phi. This is the power factor angle 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 phi. Phi is equal to 45 degree on tan phi 1 on the left. Now, the answer is 45 degrees. Next question. <coughs> In an AC circuit, the ratio of Kw bar Kva represents. Okay. Now, let's see the impedance triangle and power triangle. This is phi, this is Kw, this is Kva, R, this is Kva. Now, let's see here. KV, KW by KV and then the choice again. KV by cos phi is the cos phi is the KW divided by KV and then the other. KW divided by KV and then the other. That is power factor and then the answer right to it. Cos phi is the power factor and then the KW divided by KV and then the other.